these are the materials you're going to need. I got all these from Sally's. The hair dye that is purple, I end up returning that and got a different color. The blue powder, I paid $17.39. The clear developer, I paid $2.99. The hair dye, I paid $7.99. Now, this is not a permanent hair dye. This will fade after a few washes. This is a good hair dye if you like to change your color up a lot. The shampoo, I paid $8.49. And for the conditioner, I paid $8.39. And these are good shampoo and conditioners to wash your hair with after you dye your hair. Now, it will be a lot cheaper if you become one of their members, of Sally's members. I'm not. I don't really dye my hair that much. But my daughter, I guess I'm going to buy one now because my daughter is like into this hair color changing up thing now. Now we're gonna go ahead and part the hair in the middle. You want to make sure you have dirty hair when you're bleaching and dyeing your hair. You want your hair dirty. You have to make sure it's straight. So after you're done parting it down all the way down, you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna div divide it in sections and pin it up. Okay so what I did was I divide it down I separate it in parts and then I pin them up. I'm going to start from the tips, work myself up to here. Don't want to hit the roots yet. This is last. So we're going to do the tips first. So that's how it looks. I use 15 tablespoons of blue powder, 30 tablespoons of developer, and the way you do that, each time you use a tablespoon of blue powder, you're going to double it with your developer. So let's say you use 5 tablespoons of blue powder and you're going to times it by 2, so you're going to use 10 tablespoons of developer. Okay, so this is how it came out. And we're going to go ahead and apply it. Start with the tips. Make sure you're getting both sides. We want to get in between. We don't want, you know, us burnettes. We got to be careful because we want all our hair to get bleached. And you're going to make sure it's in there. So we're going to stop from right here and work ourselves down. Okay, so we want to get all the um, hair covered blue. I did the roots very slowly. I just went really slow, hitting the roots. And then, because um, you don't want cheetah print hair, I would go each end, lift a little bit, make sure it's all blonde in between. And I'll just make sure all around and I'll do that all around to see if it's all blonde. You see how it's all blonde? Because you will get cheetah print. We started at 4.05 and now it's 5.43 so you know it took a, it took a while but at least we got it all and now we're going to go ahead and wash it off. I'm going to wash it off in the sink so I could just wash this side off and worry about this side and then she's going to take a shower and she'll wash her hair together. This is how it looks. It's been already three days since we bleached it. I recommend to keep your hair parted if you're going to re-bleach or dye your hair in a different color because it is difficult to get each strand on one side. So I end up putting six scoops of blue powder and 12 scoops of developer. I went ahead and divided her hair in sections and I'm going to go ahead and start from here down and then after we're going to do the roots. Okay since this is our second coat we're just going to hurry up and plast it on. <laughs> and we don't want it we don't want to keep it on too long because it is our second coat so just make sure you know you spread the hair apart and get your fingers and rub it through to make sure and always wear gloves. Alright so this is the end product. All she needs to do is put the color of her choice. She didn't want to do the purple so we're going to return that and probably get a blonde or no, what did you want Savannah? You want that silver. She wanted like a silver look and this is how it looks and make sure you have it separated because it does tend to get on that side. So you have to really part it really, really good. And look at her t-shirt's perfect. We got the we got the good strength card right here. This is the strength. And we got the death card. Right here's death. <laughs> we made a small clip of a 1970s commercial. Enjoy. Oh, Savannah, it's hot today. Do you want an ice cream? Sure. Here. Oh my god, Savannah, where'd you go? 
pyramid, a nice nutritious snack for a hot summer day just to get away and disappear. It's still for me. I just don't feel like I feel like that was straight, but that's just me. It's still feeling. I don't know how to turn off. <laughs> it's just me. It's still. Ooh, kids. Probably line it up from right here, your nose down. So that's the. This thing's crooked. Oh, I just cracked it. Oh, that's fully on YouTube. Right there. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos. Bye.